counting double digit thousand stacks. <laughs> Yo guys, um, sorry about last video, I didn't realize that it was going to be that messed up, um, be being sideways, because I had it sideways and it seemed really small, so I'll rewatch this one, make sure it's good, I'm going to re-go over the, the car real quick, just because when I watched the video, it was terrible, um, don't mind the teddy bear, <laughs> alright, um, like I said, you know, you got your, the, the tires, I did run it out in the dirt today, um, it's not a car you want to hit full throttle with right away, like anywhere. I'll show you guys the bottle or body. I got this little strip of light. Hold on. I'm having a hard time getting this body clip off. <clears throat> okay. I got that one. Oh, and I lost one last night. Uh, it did a, a bad rollover. Um, and one of the body posts actually bent a little bit. So I do recommend moving to the metal, the metal um, parts if you can. If not, I mean, it's totally fine. Uh, I was doing jumps last night and all that. Um, doing some rollovers. Uh, it kind of rolled over on me. But let's see if we can get something good on that. See that? We got that from doing wheelies and stuff. Um, if, you're, if you're on asphalt, this thing will get enough grip to just flip but not like backflip flip it will just kind of stand up and flip over uh so i mean like i said all this stuff is is taking a beating and it's the second day i've had it um but a lot of throttle control with it I, it does really good in turns i have yet to um walmart didn't have the the tripod that i was wanting but um Everything's doing really fine. Uh, I I do when I don't like. Um, it's kind of like a, a. That's not hot no more. That's like slightly warm. Um, the uh, it'll kind of just stop, stop going, but it will still turn. Uh, when the battery dies, uh, you get about 10, 15 minutes of runtime depending on where you run it. When I was running it last night, I got I think about. 20 minutes i was doing some high speed some little jumps off the curb because we have the rounded off curb um some wheelies stuff like that um uh connection the connection the length for the 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 transmitter and the receiver and all that like with the the two-in-one really good um uh it it did really good uh it goes pretty far i don't know exactly how far um I did have to, um, from doing jumps and stuff last night, I went out to the dirt, I went to go drive it, and I couldn't turn left. So this was not going back. Um, I just uh, unscrewed the uh, this piece right here. I just unscrewed that, took it all off, straightened the this out and then I turned I turned it on and had the the servo kind of reset itself kind of and uh, put it back on screwed it on and it was fine um, it just got knocked around a little bit um, I did do some jumps with it uh, it did really good on the jumps not too much damage on the bottom again the back just from wheelies um, front from I want to say just rolling it and maybe the curb uh, from jumping back down from the curb. Um, you might want to watch out for the, the screws that are right here. Let me get it in the sun, that little sun spot. There's a screw right here and then right here. I don't know if you guys can see it right there. We'll do that. See there and then right there. Um, <clears throat> No screws have uh, came loose on me um, as of right now. Nothing has came loose. Nothing is broke. Like I said, the body post did bend, but it's so flexible. It kind of just bent back for me. Uh, hopefully, um, I know I'll be able to. I got some 
the lights the lights for the body um, probably came in today so I have to go check the mail because it's a little package um, the uh, the carrier hubs that were recommended to upgrade they are on their way um, I have $36 pending in PayPal from selling some stuff so once that comes through and by then I'll have a job so upgrades will be really easy um, so when that comes through, I'm either going to go with more metal parts, if you guys, if you guys think that's what best, or I'm going to order, I'm either going to order a heat sink or I'm going to just completely take these out because I found a system that already has the same connector, but it's brushless, um, and it has its own ESC, but I don't know exactly where I would mount the ESC. I want to say right here maybe so when we flip this over it would be right here and then kind of like off a little bit then just slide the receiver right under that way I'll be able to use the lights because as of right now I won't be able to use the lights unless I maybe try to disconnect that um, So, I mean, but other than that, again, it's keeping its speed. It's, um, it's not slow. I mean, shocks did all right on jumping. Again, yes, it did bottom out a lot, but my jumps weren't super big. So it kind of did, it did what it needed to do. Um, in the air, like it, it, depending on the jump, because a couple of jumps, I like when I let or I let off the throttle right when it hits mid air or like when it right after it gets off the jump, I let it go to see what it's doing. Um, I haven't been able to find out which way it favors front or back. Um, I'm going to go back. There's some more um, shaped shaped up jumps uh better edges and all that more kind of it's more like it's got more of a like a ramp shape these ones were kind of just stiff straight not curved um but like i said honestly durability is i love the durability of this car i mean i have i have done cartwheels with it you know i did lose the body pin um from doing a uh a wheelied but it because it was dying like you could tell it was dying but i wheelied and it flapped back and uh i guess knocked it off and i um uh the body was kind of like this kind of like this on it so i was like uh oh and um, I was glad that it did, the body post didn't break, but I'm going to need to upgrade to some aluminum or metal. Uh, I did have it set to where the bumper was in front of the car just just now. Um, don't know exactly how. <laughs> um, yeah, see, now it's not one to... Oh, there we go. Kind of just smash the front a little bit but um if you do plan on you know if rolling a lot um i think one thing that i don't like about the body setup right now is it looks too far forward like it the body looks like it should be more back to me like it should be right there to me anyways so when it comes down so it should be behind the bumper. So when it comes down, it kind of the tires fit perfectly in the fenders. But since it's over that, it doesn't exactly fit. It look, looks like that. So that the the rear fender piece right here in the back kind of gets close to the tire. Um, the motor does get really hot. I don't know exactly how hot, but overall, right now, um, it's really good. I'm enjoying it. I've had tons of fun. Out in the dirt, I got maybe, I want to say, 10 minutes of runtime on a full battery. Uh, so not too bad um, for a little 1500 milliamp uh, 2S. Uh, I want to maybe order 
if they do have like nickel metals for this just to see the the type of uh, power difference and all that because it it's really quick but the hard part is is once you get up to speed it's hard to keep it straight because sometimes the tires will slide and just slip and it'll go one way or the other um but overall i'm enjoying this car for the first two days that i've had it um oh actually that whole piece came out that's just the film over the the body um uh but yeah um when the battery does die and the throttle's not working don't freak out uh like if it, if it just stops stops going and you've been out playing in a little bit and all that it could be that the battery's dying or is dead um you will still have steering but again like i said no throttle but that's why i wanted to try the nickel metal um because it's um I want to see if it's just like if it has a built-in like light bulb cutoff because it doesn't exactly say if it does or doesn't and in the reviews it doesn't really say um but um they do have a uh a setup for this that that goes with the 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 two-in-1 esc the brushless setup but it comes with different connectors this other setup that I found comes with the same Dean's connector for the battery. That's the only reason why I'm going to go with it. Uh, it's like 25 bucks, super cheap. Um, do a review on that. Uh, but overall, I'm really enjoying this car. Um, maybe get some more grippy tires for the street. Um, there's no traction rolling like that I can tell unless you're turning and then you just gun it. It'll probably either spin out or just uh kind of wheelie my bad i almost dropped the phone but uh that'll be it for this little extra review um hope you guys enjoy like comment subscribe and we'll see you again